this has been a classic confrontation this afternoon of man versus machine. Oh, there it is. And Kasparov has soundly defeated the Neutron 9000. Thank you. Thank you. I find it amusing. All machines are just wires, nuts, and bolts. They're stupid by nature. I have no information about my opponent. Why is that, uh, that you don't get a look at any of these games? So? <laughs> you ask the wrong person. <laughs> The first game, Deep Blue played very strangely. You know, like, this is wonderful. Isn't life beautiful? We lost the first game. But if you look at us, if you actually see, see the team, how, how we actually behaving, we were actually a fairly happy bunch. The reason for that, we were sufficiently comfortable. We know Deep Blue is sufficiently strong. Kasparov knows the computer will not be hobbled by human weaknesses, such as a lack of concentration. But Kasparov can enjoy human advantages, such as being devious. And Gary gets into a very difficult position, arguably a losing position. Kasparov's play during the second game of his match with an IBM computer called Deep Blue. He resigned in the middle of what he considered a hopeless situation. Instead of fighting for a draw, the match now stands at one game apiece. What did you guys do to it last night? <laughs> <laughs> we we not had a couple of cocktails. <laughs> and he came back and he said, how can this be? Kasparov managed only a draw, leaving the series even, one and one-half games each. Maybe he should, he should come to grips with the fact that Deep Blue can do a lot of things that he did not think were possible. And the IBM computer, Deep Blue, ended in a draw after five hours. Kasparov admitted he was too tired to go on. Deep Blue and Gary Kasparov, the world chess champion in the IBM supercomputer, played to a draw in yesterday's fifth match. Some said Kasparov played more like a supercomputer and Deep Blue more like a human. They're at one game each and three draws going into today's final match, in which Deep Blue has the advantage of making the first move. critical mistake. He's going to lose this game. Deep Blue, the IBM computer, beat Garry Kasparov, considered to be the best chess player in the history of the game. And whoa! Deep Blue Kasparov the great Russian champion was not a graceful loser. I made one big mistake before this match. It was nothing to do about uh, further investigation. 
of uh, computer potentials chess, there was one zeal to be Gary Kasparov. And uh, when a big corporation with unlimited resources would like to do so, there are many ways to achieve the result. The IBM PR people told us that we should not smile. And right over here is Deep Blue. Which one? All of them? It says Deep Blue right there. Oh.